But anyway, yeah, Manafort. Manafort? Flip. We're live? What? <laughs> Let's talk uh, about Manafort. I don't want to talk about that now. <laughs> <laughs> now that we're live, I'll talk about it later. <laughs> let me, uh, let me, uh, move these boys. Okay. Let me move. How do I move them? Oh, I found it. Yeah, uh-huh. put them up there so we can see the chat. Hello, everyone. I'm Hugo. I'm Jack! I'm doing all the hard work! And welcome to the PO Unboxing on Hugo and Jake. How come this... We have a lot of packages this time, and oh, look at all the sharp objects. I'm not going to be able to touch these we later. We lots of sharp objects. Jake doesn't tend to let me touch these because... You know why? I'm, because I'm fairly irresponsible with sharp objects. It doesn't have nothing to do with it. If you can't tell. All right, I guess we're just going to do it in white instead of night mode like the oh. Lord intended. That should sound fine. Let me know if uh, is the sound okay. Is, uh, pl- oh, okay. All right. Everything slow. Are we live? Yes, we are. Slow. Slow mode on. Okay, that's fine. Slow mode needs to be on. You goddamn... Has Hugo gone Fight Club and admitted Jake is not real? If Jake was a part of my psyche, I'd do more than shoot myself in the cheek. I'd make sure I got right in the medulla. 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 Whatever. Medulla. See, this is Actually, the kind no, of... it's not a... It's not a... Why is this here? Paul, get the fuck out of here. Oh, God. <laughs> I hit the light switch. Okay, we're good. That's why you can't... It's you fine. Can't... That'll start an electrical fire later. You can't tempt the fates by <laughs> bad-mouthing Paul. <laughs> okay, that's He keeps the lights on in this place. Anyway. It doesn't hurt. Yeah. Um, Caleb Merwin, I'd be honored to be acknowledged by your eminence. You're welcome. Okay. So, first up. Oh, uh, announcement. After this stream, after this stream, maybe a half hour roughly, um, we're going to be going over to the Twitch channel, and we're going to be doing a live Q&A about our brand new live D&D stuff, uh, Charisma Saves. Um, and so you guys will be able to ask questions about the world and the characters and all that stuff, if you're interested, if not, whatever. Um, and then, right after that, we're running a rerun of first episode. Cool. So, that should be good. And we might do that, like, weekly. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, okay, so this is from William. Do you like William, or do you want me to open it? William's a good name. Alright, I'll give you a little, a little slit near the top. Okay. I know, you, can, you don't trust me you can, with the sharps. I don't... Okay. Which is a good choice. Yeah, I, oh, oh, it's one of those... It's... Okay. I don't know what it is about this USPS... It's like it's like bird nest material? Why, who who at USPS was like, you know what we should put on the inside that... You know, it's really soft? Bird nests it's made like of bird, lint. Bird plumage. Little known fact, every employee of USPS yeah. is a bird. That's right. My mom is a bird. Yeah, that's oh. matter. Bird-like... She's very bird-like. Ugh, there's a bunch in of... origin. So let's see. We got two different. We have a bag. Oh, nah. Sarah's gonna be mad if we don't have a bag. Sarah! <laughs> we need a receptacle. Okay. Thanks. Thank you. Uh, we have two movies here. This one, The Hollywood Tribe, reaching the utmost part of the Thirty Mile Zone (TMZ). The Thirty Miles. What's explain? Uh, the Thirty Mile Zone, the TMZ, as it were. This is where the news outlet TMZ gets its name. The Thirty Mile Zone is oh. the Thirty Mile Zone around Hollywood in which union rules apply. So it is, by all definitions, it is what Hollywood is. It's where they make the movies oh. because of the union rules. Thank you. I appreciate your existence. Yeah. Uh, and that's why, like, the effects houses, the uh, the people who rent the cameras... There's the, only 30 miles in which you 30 can have square union rules. Why? Uh, it's just how it was zoned at the time. I don't know. Anyway. Times are changed! Challenging the church to embrace Hollywood as a mission field. So it's how to proselytize in Hollywood. Uh, don't do it. It fails. And then we ride to D.C. The mainstream media's war against the truth. We won't make headlines, but we will make Who's a difference. Who's that guy? He looks chiseled. Dennis Michael Lynch. Everyone knows Dennis Michael Lynch, yeah. the famous actor. It's 2013. Many U.S. citizens. It's 2013. In this. that that free, long ago. Huh? It's a documentary. Yeah. Oh. Many U.S. citizens feel the Obama administration's plan to transform America endangers the nation's future. Oh boy. Wow. That's isn't that funny to hear now. Like, oh, that Obama and his evil schemes. No, he was he was competent at his job. Anyway. I forgot. I forgot that he was, uh, the Republicans were like, ah. Yeah. 
Uh, they fight back with one grassroots protest after another, but the mainstream media either ignores or falsely reports these events. This film takes a hard look at what fuels the media's liberal bias. Is this... So, is this a Christian film? It's more of a... Fucking... Oh, this uh, makes me want to cut myself. This is like a Alex Jonesy Fox News type movie, which we might do. Maybe we'll put it on our Christian movie quickies and in as a wild oh. card of sorts. Oh. Thank you. For your How DVDs. long is that? How long? Thank you, Michael. Is that your name? Richard, I think you said. Richard. William. William. It was William. William. It was William. I remembered because of. Uh... Doesn't have a minutes marker no. on there. I oh, this is just indefinite. Yeah, in definite pain. I remember, Put this in your DVD player. I remembered William only because Westworld. Uh, Blacksmith, $5. Why do you think people are becoming more socially isolated despite us being more interconnected Didn't than ever Didn't we before? answer this question? We've answered similar questions, but part of that has to do like with the recently. fact that we are able to interact with others without leaving the comfort of our homes, and we're able to do it in a way that is... I can flirt, more... I can flirt with you blacksmith without taking my pants or putting my pants on and it's in a marginally safer way in that you are not as exposed often you are anonymous or often you are at the very least there is a some sort of border between your real self and your internet avatar whether it be a screen name or whatever people are more brave on the yeah. internet for various reasons whether sure. that's to be an asshole or, or just to, to just to actually be are. able to uh, yeah. talk to people because you're socially awkward sure which is not something I experience, so I'm exactly the same, which is which is a problem. <laughs> Next package. This one's heavy. And this one's from Carlson. Okay, Carlson. Carlson? Just a Carlson? Mm. I think it's a... Is that a first or last name? I'm, I think I should open it from the bottom. It's less, it's less sealed. Eh. I'm going to go with that. It's a bomb. Either way, we're going to die. Oh. Well, that's... Should I dox this person in case it's a bomb? What are the odds it isn't a bum? Plus, I'm opening it from the bottom. No way they expected that. <laughs> I've disarmed this bum. I am a god. That looks like glass. Nope. Nope. Here it is. It's... It's some Carlson honey. Pure, raw, and local. This would be my third thing of honey. You want to try some honey? Sure. And okay. if we have a bunch of honey, I'll actually take that because I'm out of honey. Do you, do you, and I really do you like, frequent honey? I, I like natural I have honey. Some, I, have some, I, like uh, honey. I like honey toast. I like raw breakfast. honey. Yeah. I have the raw honey where you got to like stir yeah. it. And then I also have the, um, I have, uh, it was mixed with tart cherries. Huh. It's very delightful. By the way, I just got one of these off without my teeth. Good jam. Let's take a little bit off the side there. That's good honey. That's solid good. honey. Thank you to your bees or whatever. Thank you for Carlson Honey, made in. There's no label for where it was made. I'll like look a, at the information. Actually, Is there a card? Now there's a card. We got a we got a thing. I like the logo though. It's simple. Hello, sirs. I greatly enjoy your content and wish you the best. Enjoy some sweetness from Iowa. My favorite is drizzled over vanilla ice cream. Uh, P.S. Is Hugo as frightened of bees as butterflies? I don't think so. Uh, more in like a, I just don't want to get stung way, but they don't right. freak me out or anything. I don't think, I don't think most, are most people just, are any, is any, is anyone like. Some people are more phobic no, than others. freaked but. out by like bees, not for any other reason besides the sting. Yeah, there might be. Uh, Sex Abacus, when can we expect the return of Kenneth at some point? At some at point! At some point! Someday, provided neither of us die before then. That's a pretty safe promise to that make, right? That is safe. We should just make that promise about everything. Provided we don't die before it happens, it'll happen. It's bulletproof. We aren't, though. That's... Which is why we had the caveat. Yeah. Because maybe we get shot. Yeah. Message yeah. retracted. What was it? Now we don't get to know. Butterfly, 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 butterfly. Is it like... Ah, something gang, whatever. No, no. Hugo Jack. That's pretty funny. Oh, where'd they get a stamp? Jackchickflick.com. They got like uh Join the Chick Tract Club for collector's kit. $15 to Monster Wax at AOL. What the fuck? 
Okay. I'm someone gonna... someone probably sent away for something from Chick Publications in our name, sort of. Yeah, it's... Here you go. <laughs> this is a weird uh, package for a film uh, or a movie or whatever. Uh, oh, wait, it's got a tab. Yeah, it's got a Just tab. pull the tab. I'll pull the tab. Put that, put that in the hole! What's this do? The Lost Continent. We have not done that. Is this real? It's a talking chick. 46 minutes. Oh god, it's two parts. Wait, why are they on CDs? April 19th. I don't even have a CD drive. Florida Radio Active Radio. Talking Chick Part 1 and P Talking Chick Part 2. This is presumably some sort of radio it's show they protract. Something they did in 2001. April of 2001. Pre-9-11. So that's fun. Uh, so I guess we could maybe listen to that and hear what they have to say. I'm sure Jack is probably on there. Uh, Pre-death. Uh, Mexico is the most neglected missionary-wise. I don't think that's true, and if it is true, you know why? Oh, look! You there's know? a co there's a communist Cuban! A dictator, if you will. Cuban. Yeah, we need that with it. It goes with. Cuba isn't Mexico. Secondly, if missionaries are skipping over Mexico, it's because sure. they're already Christian. Yeah. They love, they love, they love Maria. What? You know they pray. There a lot of them are Catholic, so oh. they, they pray uh, the Rosary and shit. Right, but that was like a Italian. Yeah. Asp we love a Maria. Yeah. That's how Mexicans sound. I'm bad at accents. We have established this not as a bit, as a fact of my life. Wouldn't it be? Is it worse if you're good? Like a fact of your life is you're good at accents, and you walk around like, like, uh, hey, sir, can I? What can I get you? And you're at like a like a restaurant. Sure. You're like I'm having a pizza. Having a pizza. I don't think anyone would respond well to you. Uh, they don't generally anyway, so it's fine. You don't walk around and people are like, "Ooh, I don't want to spend time with that guy." Eh, that's how it feels. Well, good. Okay. Jesus, Jesus man. man. We saw it at the same time. We are in sync. Okay. Uh oh. Nice paper again. Dear Hugo and Jake, I promised to get you guys some more terrain for your gaming table, and I delivered on that promise. Wow. For a bit, I considered making a large, intricate, and badass building. However, I figured that having one piece of terrain on the table would not accomplish much for you. So I decided to make a bunch of smaller things for you to start off. That way, it's easier to put multiple things on the table to work with. I figured this is a much better option for newer gamers who are just starting off with their terrain collection. I have included for you City and Rural Roads. Crates filled with goods, carts, merchant stalls. These are some basic things that you can use over and over. I hope you enjoy using them in your games. I have some neat ideas to get you guys some more things over the next few months. Some of the basics that I can really enhance the table. I do need to know the dimensions of your gaming table for one of the things I plan on getting you. Trust me, you will like it when the time comes. Rad as fuck. This person is the coolest. And lastly, I have one more question. You two have made mention of a meet-and-greet camping weekend here in Michigan. I know a bunch of your fans think of this would be awesome. Do you still plan to do this? If so, do you have any time frame? Uh, yeah, we do uh, intend to do that uh, probably next year and n probably in the spring or fall or early, early fall. Okay. Like a late September or early, like April, May. Okay. Although it's a little cold sometimes, so even sure. up into June, so it's not super hot, but okay. yeah, something like that. Okay, and then so this is this is very cool. And again, this is from Eric, who is a uh, 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 oh, your future gay lover apparently. That's how he signs these. Oh, okay. Ooh. Why do you like to pop these? I have no opinion. It's the satisfaction. Shh, shh, shh. Right, that one didn't do it. The satisfaction is self-evident. I don't like it. <laughs> Yet I'm not allowed to touch the sharper things. So. Okay. This is ASMR now. Ready? That's over. 
that's too bad. Over. If we'd stuck with the ASMR, we'd hit a million subs by now. Ooh, these are cool. Yeah. So we have like little merchant stalls, little cats. Cart. I am so shocked these were delivered without being destroyed. Yeah, these are actually really dope. Thank you so much. Woo! Let me move these over here. These will be used yeah. since we are now streaming the game. This is more to save space. At this yeah, point. yeah, I get that. <laughs> more goodies in here. These are roads and stuff, I guess. If I can get enough of this kind of stuff, it will be quite nice. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm not going to go through each one of these, but they're like road pieces that you can mix and match. Ooh, I like the cardstock, too. And cobblestone and stuff like that. These are really fucking cool. Thank you so much. That's awesome. Thank you very these much. These are actually really awesome. If you don't know the value of these, um, play a tabletop game once. <laughs> and you'll be yeah. like, oh. Yeah. That is super cool. I'm going to. So that's awesome. Thank you very much. set these. Very helpful. I appreciate helpful gifts. Moving on to something that will obviously be helpful is this from Amazon Fulfillment Services. Oh, okay. Thanks, Amazon Fulfillment <laughs> Services. Camp Roofed Gate. <laughs> Camp Roofed Gate. Yeah. Nah, we'll set a we'll set an actual date. Maybe a painful question, but what happened to Hugo? What? That's just that's just a hurtful thing to say. That implies what? I look like shit or something. Or maybe they meant me? No, 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 that says Huga. Oh. <laughs> That's very different. That is different. Let me see. This is manga of some sort, and as such will not be read, most likely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you know what? I appreciate the weebs that try. You know what? I do. I really like, do. They, they, Maybe this is one something day. like they, they, they like and they want to share with us. And I'll tell you what, not once have I thrown it away. It's sitting on my bookshelf. It's yeah. at my house. Someday maybe I'll be I'll, I'll, high I'll, enough. I don't know. I don't even know what that partake. would look like. <laughs> A world in which you're like, you know what? Maybe some manga today. Like I don't know what that looks like, but if that day happens, I'll be prepared. And this is Overlord, uh, two different volumes of it. Uh, volume four and five. Did you already get? The, I'm not did you gonna, already get the other ones? I might. Have. <laughs> Or are they in another box? Maybe they might, they're probably there in another box. But if it is, you just sell. If you just sent me four and five, yeah, I'm gonna be very confused. Yeah. But thank you, nonetheless. I'm so trying I, really hard, by the way, to break everything down. You're doing a great job. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Yep. I hope my encouragement is helping you. And yeah, that's you doing. Feel validated. It's doing good. Another <laughs> one from Amazon fulfillment service. There was no note in there, by the way. Yeah. I would love to give you credit. So add notes. Because you're great. Oh. Well. Here's some more overlord. Oh, here we go. Okay, there we go. There's volume one and two. No. This is volume <laughs> two and six. Where's volume one? Uh, I don't know. There's another thing down here, though. That's probably I'm it. I'm gonna guess. I'm gonna guess this is it. Why was the other one in a box? Uh, no. No. Those are... Seven and three! Where the fuck is one? I don't... I don't understand. Maybe I just don't Do the get Japanese to... number things differently than us? Maybe. Is that what it is? I don't think I get to know how it started. They sent us the whole series except for the first one. It makes sense. Wow, but... actually, if you send everyone the whole series but the first one, you are an evil mastermind. You know the difference is? None, because I'm not going to read it either way. Wow! So. Yeah, probably not me either. I would love to have the time to read things. Maybe when I retire. Maybe when I'm really old. Hold on. I'll here's another a one. Huge weeb. Maybe this is. Wait, just... no. This one's. This okay. one's. This one's different. What if I become a weeb in old age and we're in the same old folks' home? No one's putting us in homes. We'd have to put ourselves in homes. If by home you mean under underpass, then yeah. Yes. We we'll could... weeb old men in underpasses. Okay. This is A B. What's A-B? This is from A-B. I don't okay. know. This is from A-B. Okay. It's their name. Aw, oh, God Psychiatry. 
Healing for your troubled heart, Charles L. Allen. Only two ninety nine to solve all your problems. That's nice. That's not terrible. Ancient wisdom for a happier and healthier life today with more than 1.5 million copies sold at only two ninety nine. That's a pretty good deal. God Psychiatry <laughs> shows you how to acquire confidence, courage, and a new look on life. Banish fear and worry. Root out hate and suspicion. Uh, maybe don't read the Bible then. Uh, bring out the best in yourself. Generate appreciation for your friends and coworkers. Probably your typical self-help stuff uh, mixed in with some Jesus stuff, if I had to guess. With God, all things are possible. Let's put that up here. That's good. That's good for the kids that watch the show. Um, in in Disney font for the record. Disney font. I don't know if you can tell. Disney font. Sure. Dear Nazi Hitler the Flash and Harold P. Penisman. That's me. I'm the second one. I see... Oh, wow. This is... Look, this is irregularly cut. Yeah. I've been a big fan since I found you guys through your time changer review. True, uh... Truly through the Lord, all things are possible, including a pair of hilarious atheists like you making YouTube atheism TM fun again. Unfortunately, I can't credit you two wonderful bull bros with making me think about my religious indoctrination as I had already given that shit up dozens of years before I had ever heard of you guys. Fine! But your movie reviews, Bible study, are terrific and your chick track readings are just the best. So glad I found a channel that finds these little comics as awesomely hilarious as I do. On to the goodies. Enclosed is a book, God Psychiatry, that I found at Kroger that I worked at until just recently. I've since promoted myself to a customer. <laughs> Thought Hugo would find this infuriatingly interesting. Oh. By now you should have received two eBay packages, one large, one small, both from me. They'll pro they're probably over there somewhere. Maybe. I guess I'll save the letter. Okay. Unless you would like a sneak peek on what's in there. Now wait. There's a large box. Okay. Your secret's safe with me. <laughs> Bunna. Mallory Gilmore, 499. I once went to church and they spoke in tongues. I asked what happens if you fake it, and the lady said, You go to hell. It solidified my atheism. Huh. Guess. Not the tongues. The part where if you lie about it, you go to hell. Okay. I get it. Yeah. That makes some sense. I've never seen tongues in person. All those people are going to hell then. Yeah. yeah. Every single one of them. Good thing it's not real. It's it too works bad. out. Yeah. Safe gambit, you know? <laughs> Alright. This is a, a box from Alex. And this is for you. I feel like this person has sent us stuff before. I could be wrong. Oh, no. Wait, is this good or bad? Uh, D&D &D minis, maybe? Ooh! On, yeah, there. some cool ones. Are there other shit in here? There's oh, a yeah. note. Ooh, there's like men in black guys. That's pretty Dope. cool. Dope. Let me read this. Dear Hugo. Oh, there's more! Dear Hugo. If you more. have more of these, send them! If anyone has any minis that, that you don't want, that'd be great. Of course, obviously, I can't send them back. I have some them. extra minis taking up space, so here you go. Sorry that the minis are unbased, but I. A lot have, of them are unbased. Yeah, we have bases, we have actually. Bases. I have bases at home, actually, yeah, that I need to bring over for ones that I think I gave you already. Yep. Uh, I had to use them for other minis I have. Most of the minis come from a game called HeroScape, but there are some from DD. Uh, and they all work the same, you know. Really, they're just tiny little things. For it doesn't have to be a D and D brand miniatures, right. as long as they're I think 15 millimeter or something like that. Yeah. I'm a big fan of the stuff you guys do, so keep doing what you're doing, Alex. Thanks, Alex. I, I hope really you enjoy the stream, it. Alex. Yeah, I'm sure you'll see some of these on there. We got some. Oh, this is cool. Cause we got some like. Maybe this weekend. Who knows? Check that out. What is this fucking thing? Bone guy. Ah, I want to use him. This is pretty cool. Look at Bone guy. Bone guy is rad. Guy in a suit with a sword and a gun. Okay, this is Violent Gordy LaForge. Wait, Jordy? Jordy. Jordy LaForge. You can't really see it very well. Wait, does he have a... Sh Never mind, he has, he, has a, he has a ponytail. Here's K from Men in Black. Is that's it? That literally just looks... That's just a K from Men in Black. I don't know what else to call it. <laughs> Yeah, some of these are mostly... Let's look at some of these bigger ones. Uh, oh, we got a dragon. A green dragon. A dragon. 
so that's cool. What the fuck? Oh my! Is that, <laughs> is that a murdered Jareth? Uh, it's like a skeleton thing riding a thing, and it looks like there's arms that are. I could in definitely there. make a. Oh oh! Here we go. It's a it's a skeletal dragon with a rider. Yeah. Oh, that's horrifying. Oh, you'll that's figure the other out something side. cool to do with this. I bet. Yeah. Oh God! You get the idea. Lots of cool monsters. I could have used this when we had the T Rex fight and fucking yeah. and uh, Kradash was ride was riding the T Rex. They don't know what that means. No. Oh my god. This... Some of these are really fucking cool. I love a lot of these. What's well, not? What I'm sure. This guy doing? As much as people are probably not this having is, a good this time. Is a, this we'll is a. This. Yeah. Yeah, I'm with you. Uh, put that. In. Chris says I couldn't find Euphoria on DVD. It's the game. Is the game okay, or are PC visual novel games not your cup of tea? Sorry for letting you guys down. What? Not a big fan of visual novel things, no. Uh, and then Ray... Visual novel? What are you talking... Ray, Ray, it's like a game genre. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, Euphoria, though, what's that? I don't know. Oh. Sorry for letting you guys down. I don't... Did Chris let us down? I don't know. Guess Chris, so. Chris, if you let us down, you're on, you're not forgiven. Ray Racin7, hey Hugo, and the Badger, what do you guys think of the state of the skeptic community lately? Alt-right dog whistling, mundane Matt debacle, etc. Also off-topic, thinking of changing my name to Charles M. Tomatoes, MD. <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't know. I don't know anything about the mundane Matt thing. I haven't heard about it. There's like a doxing or something, but I don't actually know. Maybe it wasn't him. I don't remember. Uh, but yeah, alt-right shit in general I find very odd. I don't know why one would align themselves with the alt-right or Make their talking points. And yeah, I... They're wrong about this so much. So, yeah. yeah. Um... Yeah. I'm not going to badmouth Mundane Man. I don't know anything about it. Maybe he deserves it. Who Maybe knows? he doesn't. I have no idea. Um, uh, also, you should definitely change your name to Charles M. Tomatoes. <laughs> when I was... Uh, this is from Chateur. Six dollars. Thank you so much. Um, when I was dragged to a Pentecostal church service a long time ago, I did my best impression of a murloc. They bought it. What's a murloc? Murloc. That sounds familiar. I'm getting a. I'm getting a, like a like a homunculus face in my head. I'll look it up. With long fingers. I'll look it up. I could be wrong. I'm thinking those aren't the monsters from Land of the Lost. Is right? that what it is? What? World of Warcraft. Oh, I don't play that game. <laughs> you degenerate. <laughs> anyway. Ugh. Oh, I broke it. This is from Katrina. The hurricane? Yes. You don't care about black people, I've heard. No, wait, that was the president at the time. I guess. I don't the, think Katrina I don't did think either. The, the storm did either. I don't think it cared stories. about any any race of folk. No. It's a it's an egalitarian storm. It just so happened to hit. <laughs> you know. Well. Below sea level. My, my, uh, Sarah used to live in that area. Yeah. During Katrina. She's dead now. It was nice of you to prop up her waterlogged <laughs> corpse in the room and talk to it like yeah. she's real, though. It's yeah. nice to keep her memory alive. This is a letter! This is the main letter. Open last. Okay. Main letter. I like, I like, um, when I get instructions in a box... There's something about it. It's, gets like me. A, it's like a dumb sub relationship. That's a via little package. bit. It's a little bit like that. Let me, let me set this boy on down. There we go. Okay. Dear Hugo and Jake, hiya! I watch your guys' mail opening live streams all the time, and I thought that maybe I should get in on that action. You should have. And you did. Good call. Of course, I didn't want to just send a letter. I wanted to send you guys more than that. I had a hard time figuring out what to send, so it's just an odd assortment of things with no apparent theme. Sorry, if there is anything you don't want, feel free to throw it away or something. Guilt-free! Implying we've ever had guilt about throwing away the things you thought hard and long about sending us. Um... I'm not sure how you guys feel about being sent stuff that has no merit being shown on the channel. Fine. 
I assume people send you guys a lot of material that has become more of a collection rather than something worth showing to an audience. If that's the case, then I like to add the enclosed stuff to that collection. Enjoy! That's true to an extent. I know for a fact. Well, we like, show it all on here, but... I know we show it, but, like, for instance, I have more Christian movies on my shelf than we than can we, ever go through. Than we could ever go through yeah. if we did this for the next 20 years. Well, like, it, we just couldn't do it. And I love that collection. I love going through it and looking at it and looking at some of the weird movies. Yeah. But, you know... I also have a slightly serious question to ask. Brace yourself. Okay. I could be wrong. Brace but it doesn't look like you both are still losing weight anymore. How did you manage to stop? Wait, what? Oh, it's... Personally, I'm always trying to lose a few more pounds. I'm never quite happy with the way I look. Oh, 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 oh. It's, it used to be... I see. I see. It's uh, because laziness. Laziness, and I started eating way too much food again. I'm eating yeah. more calories than I'm burning per day. It's as simple as that, and I need to get back on a more healthy eating schedule uh, and stay on it. I was saying earlier, I feel like Oprah. I'm, I'm skinny Hugo, I'm fat Hugo, skinny Hugo, fat Hugo. You're not back to fat Hugo yet. I'm, by weight, I am. Uh. But, you know. Unless maybe you squished your face down and did this. May, maybe it's distributed differently than it was before, I think, but I'm by weight. I, I I'm think, where I was before I, I, think, I was. I uh, think, well, there was also alcohol. That's well, fair. I don't want to throw this away. So maybe that maybe it that maybe might it have sat different. Bloat. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's Coke. I think you get Coke bloat. Coke bloat. Which I've never had. Okay. Coke or Coke bloat, for that matter. Is that a thing? I don't know. Coke I've, bloat. I've heard that as a punchline, so it's got to be based on something, right? Oh, like after you're done doing Coke. Yeah. That makes sense because you did a bunch of Coke. Right. Now spending it on pizza. Yeah. Yeah. This book is horseshit, birthed by the satanic panic, and is uh, one man's opportunism and grasp for fame. I hope you enjoy it if you choose to read it. This is The Satan Seller by Mike something. I, it got stolen from me. Thrift right, books! Right as I was going to tell you the author name. Mike Warnke, after being expelled from the Satanist Thai priesthood, joined the U.S. Navy and became a combat corpsman with the U.S. Marines. During his six months of Vietnam duty as a medic, he was <laughs> wounded twice and honored with eight service medals. Upon his return to America, he re-enlisted in the Navy and became a certified cardiopulmonary technician. He received an early discharge from the Navy to devout full-time effort to a San Diego-based anti-occult counseling network known as Al Alpha Omega Outreach. Oh, this guy's just lying about everything he's ever done in his life, isn't he? Yes. That's unfortunate. Found this gem at Salvation Army. It made me giggle, so I wanted to send it your way. It's Halloween. What's a Christian to do? By Steve Russo. Oh my God. We'll have to. We'll read this and maybe. Oh God. Maybe for Halloween, I'll. I'll go since this is a pretty brief. I mean, yeah. this is a quick read. I can go through this, get some of the best ones, and for an episode, maybe just go through the best bits of the book. Well, we gotta do those uh, hauntings. Oh, God, we got a lot to do. Ugh. A book for my very own Lapeer. You live in Michigan. Otherwise, it's not, unless there's another Lapeer, which is totally possible. Um, I just thought you might like getting something from Lapeer, even though you may never have been here. It must be. Detours, real people, true stories. Lapeer County. Is this? Brent sneaks around on his wife, despite his best intention. Ken follows in his father's worst footsteps, drinking. Rachel's husband convinces everyone she's headed for crazy town. Afraid of jail and losing her son, Meg tries to cover her tracks. Um, it's Crash, but a book, and in Lapeer. Okay. What's this? This is this is going to be a bloody, bloody pad? I hope so. Nope. Oh. Uh, bridge card snap, one dollar wooden, what? <laughs> you needed some coins for your weird calf statue thing, right? Ask and you shall receive. Here you go. That's you're right. We should put movie. Grab movie. And what is insert this? wooden coins? Bridge card snap. No change given. It's a one dollar wooden coin for food stamps. I didn't know this was a thing. Historic farmers market of Lapeer. Bridge card snap. No change given. So it's it's wooden coins that you can use at a farmers market. You had $3 and you gave it to us. Mooby will be pleased with your welfare money. It doesn't fit. Oh. 
The bottom opens. Maybe we can get it in the bottom. Fit it in the bottom! That's generally my strategy. <laughs> <laughs> if it can't fit in the top, just butt chug it. You gotta turn it to the left. It's a screw. You're a screw. Yep. Do you want me to get it? Nope. Okay, see, I'm not I'm not crazy. Nope. Is it glued? No, because I've definitely opened that before. Have you? Yeah. Maybe you were just so strong the one time. Yeah, that must be it. <laughs> well, okay. Movie will... The we'll thing that is alter. <laughs> Chris, uh, with the 100th anniversary of World War One and round the corner... Do you think there is any correlation between the turn of the century anarchists and modern... Tangos. Um, so between anarchists and mod or modernists or postmodernists. Um, I don't think it's cyclical in 100-year spans, no. What I think is anytime you have a very progressive set, uh, I don't know, series of years in the world, and we did... The United States had a black president. That's big news for the whole world. Um, and he's not the most progressive guy. And if he is, he didn't accomplish the most progressive things. Yeah. Um, granted, that was coming off George Bush. You can't... Even if his intention was to give everyone health care and, yeah. you know... But from um, a long, it wasn't going to happen anyway. From certain people's perspectives, it yeah. seemed like a very progressive eight years. Well, well, it was. Well, not just lawmaking, though. I think socially speaking, it was yes. very progressive, including LGBTQ rights. Plus, yep. um, and so now we have people bucking against that, and yep. that's just how it works. And they're going to buck against it and lose, and then it starts back over. We push further left, which is a good thing because that's progressive. And I don't mean further left like we push more. How about forward instead of left? And so you don't have to think about it like that. Because if if we are conservative, we stand pat, which is not good. If we move forward, that is good. And we need to move forward fast enough to outpace automation. That's the goal. Yeah. Or we die. <laughs> well, not very funny. We die. Um, because our government w refuses to adapt to a world in which uh, labor is a th not a thing of the past, but uh, in not as at least... At, like it, it's at, in, it's at least at a surplus extremely ex yeah at an extreme surplus to the workload necessary to Correct. actually make society function this is from tim i don't know what it is. it's a book we aren't who we say we are Timothy oh yeah there was more is a british american freelance graphic designer currently living in the united states when he's not spending time working on clients designs for digital or print media he spends his time in other mediums like writing art and oh. philosophy much of Timothy's work can be viewed for free on social media. <laughs> what begs as a simple Same. What began as a simple hobby now has found its way to the hands of poetry lovers everywhere. Oh, is this poetry? This is a book of poetry. Book of poetry? Is this Tim? To Hugo and Jake, I love your content and just wanted to... to Share with you a, a, a little, little of my own. Okay. Pages code, pages go... Let's read poetry. Let's read a poetry? Yeah. If it's bad, we um, we act like... No, read a short one, please. There we Darkness. go. Darkness. Darkness. Couldn't read about anything happy, could you? Darkness, my friend, come unto me. Light, our foe, seeps through cracks and seeks to fill my void. <laughs> Darkness, my <laughs> I friend. I went there. Yeah. I went there. Darkness, my friend, you surround only me. With you there is no, no one, no thing, no purpose. Darkness, my friend, surround me as you do. Keep at bay the light, for it aims to open me up. Aims to open me up to the world, to expose all every inch of me. I see the light. Don't allow it, my friend. Darkness. I'm too immature to read poetry. I also need a rhyme scheme, a la Dr. Seuss, because I am a child. But thank um, you very much for your work. I'll check this out. Then we also have several movies. These look like uh, like Grindhouse movies or something. A Thief in the Night, A Distant Thunder, Image of the Beast, and A Prodigal Planet. But I think these are all God, God-oriented. Add this to the stack. Add this to the stack. Thank you. This is also, we open this last. 
Oh, wow, these are some good ones. Yeah, they're like Grindhouse Christian films. I know Brad's covered some of these. Ugh. Oh, look! In case it doesn't work, we have a Red Lobster gift card. <laughs> uh, we each have one. $25 Red Lobster gift card. You know what? Jordan Peterson's got one thing right. Lobsters are fucking Lobsters are good. Who doesn't like red lobster? Have you ever had a Cheddar Bay Biscuit, people? You gotta have some Cheddar Bay Biscuits. Dear Hugo and Jake, again, I'm really enjoying all your Jordan Peterson stuff. I didn't think I'd like it as much as I do, honestly, but I'm super invested at this point. Jordan Peterson is really interesting. So I can't wait to watch you guys go over the rest of the book. Anyway, staying with the theme of Jordan Peterson, here is the main reason I sent you guys stuff. I hope you enjoy them. Consider it a thank you for all the laughs you've given me over the years. I hope I activated the cards correctly. If I didn't, I'll just send new ones. I might be watching the stream, depending on what time it is. So, IDK, you had to get hold of you, but I guess just keep an eye out for my account. I don't know. We'll cross the bridge when we get to it. Good luck. S Twitter is the best way. Thank you. Thank you very much. Chris says, what's the thesis of the Adventure Time finale? I haven't watched it. I'm not caught up on Adventure Time. I don't know. I'm excited to have some Cheddar Bay Biscuits, though. I like Cheddar Bay Biscuits. They're so good. They are good. You know what I really like there is their Caesar salad. It's just a Caesar salad. It's not special. It's just always very nice. Mm. Big fan of salads. Big fan of them. You know what the worst part about sa Well, you don't really know the worst. You don't know the best or worst part about salad. I don't like salad. So for the fans, the best or worst part about salad, the worst part is pooping it. Because it's just roughage. It just... Comes right up. Here you go. This is from Dan... Don. 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 Maybe it's from Don. Wasn't that the name of of Heyman Lee's uh, boyfriend from season one of Serial, who everyone thinks probably is is he's very suspicious. I don't know. I was you guys, gonna... Adnan Syed, you got you familiar? I was gonna go Don Draper. Don Dom, Dom Draper, right? Don Draper. Is it Don? Man. Yeah. Not Dom. What yeah. idiot would be named Dom? Oh God. Oh no! I do collect coins though, so that's interesting. What? Did, what? Why'd you put that behind your back? <laughs> oh! Oh! I do. Oh I no! Collect coins. I'll take it. Oh no! Nineteen thirty-eight. It's real. Yeah. That's really real. Yeah. All right. Oh, can you see what? Uh, well, anyway, um, a ten. Let's just say this is worth ten units <laughs> of something you could buy at a store, maybe a Hugo Boss store, <laughs> right? You could you, you you give the you give Hugo Boss who was there yeah. at the counter at the time yeah. ten this. And he gives you a nice a patch to put on your clothing. Yeah. A nice patch. That's going to go at the bottom of the collection. <laughs> yeah. The, the, the thing they do when they search your house after the incident, whatever that is, and then they find that. Yeah, the single nut. Oh, there it is. God, there's number one. Number one. Well, at least I know where it is when I never read it. <laughs> this person went through so much trouble. I'm such a bastard. Manga is just not a thing I'm going to do, but I appreciate I appreciate the thought. And I still... How you doing, Jake? Enjoy your gift from that goddamn weeb that sends you manga now. Steven. He doesn't care. Steven's been sending us stuff forever. Hi, Steven. God damn it, Steve. It's going on my shelf. It's going to be... Probably never coming off. It's... <sighs> Glue it to the shelf. Glue it to the shelf? Yeah. Huh. That way if anyone tries to take it off and they're like, why is this glued to your shelf? Be like, get out of my house, you fucking weeb. It's a weeb trap. That sounds... It's heavy. It says open that end. It smells like peanuts. It's probably peanuts. I think it's peanuts. Did they just fill it with peanuts? I think it might just be filled with peanuts. I respect it's it. It's really heavy for just peanuts, though. Maybe the joke is, they're packing peanuts, but really they're real peanuts. 
Oh, that made I'm the, guessing that right made now. the joke less funny to me. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Yeah. If it was just peanuts without anything else. Okay, okay, definitely peanuts. I wasn't wrong. Peanut? Would you like a peanut? Eh, nah, I'm good. I am full. I don't really want a peanut either. Yeah, I like peanuts I ate though. Right before I came over. Because I knew we'd be doing this for a while. Oh. Xerox. Xerox. Okay, this is a peanutty. Fine, you can just. Dear sir or madam, I was re watching Bells of Innocence Part 2 video. And... <laughs> okay, I get the joke. Yep. At five. No, do you get the. Just... Yeah. We made fun of Mr. Good Bars. Okay. The worst candy bar, and he sent us huge ones in a box filled with peanuts. At 514, Jake plainly states, if you like Mr. Good Bars, you are wrong. I would like to know if you wow. do like Mr. Good Bars, because I would like to be... I would like to ban you from the channel. This letter is to inform you that superfan The Paul Allen does like Mr. Good Bar, so fuck you, kind sirs. As a truce, am sending you several Mr. Good Bars. There's more. Mi there's many Good Bars. I have packaged them well in packing peanuts. Fuck you, Paul! Please eat them immediately, and I will consider this matter behind us. The Paul. Allen. All right. Now I feel. Now I feel. Is that a threat, Paul? Now I feel like I have to eat a peanut. Now I know who it's from. Right. Okay. I'll eat one peanut. Peanut. I'm good. No peanut. Some people eat the shells. You no, ever encountered a gross. philistine like that? No. Okay. If you do, I bet it's someone who grew up in like Louisiana. Fresh. I was gonna say the depression. Actually, so Louisiana. Actually. <laughs> actually, you don't eat the shells, right? Okay. She does like. She does like a nice shucked peanut, though. She's a little different, though. She was born there. She's a she, little different, she's though. Like a mutant. <laughs> she's like a mutant that, like, came out more normal than the rest of the Louisiana types. <laughs> that turned into a compliment. Yeah. <laughs> Nanya says, I love Mr. Goodbar. You're wrong. It's not wrong. good. It's bad peanut to chocolate ratio. The it's ratio's bad. all wrong. I might as well, like, if you're going to eat a Mr. Goodbar, you might as well eat a Hershey's and then just... Take a handful If you're gonna of eat a Mr. Good Bar, you might as well eat a Hershey's with almond instead. Right, I, uh, yeah. I don't get it. Fuck Mr. Good Bar. Get a Snickers. It takes me so. If I if I actually. If you send me a candy bar I like. Fuck it, get a Nutrageous Bar. I don't know. If you send me a candy bar I like this size, it would take me two weeks to eat it. So peanutty in there. <laughs> uh, Shater, I'm from Louisiana. I've never seen anyone eat peanuts like that, though. Like what? Like I did? No, like uh, uh. like they eat of the shell. Oh, you better crack it, split her in half, pop the peanut out, or pop it into your mouth, and then eat it. I'm not eating this though. I don't want. Huh? Oh, this one's really cool. Look how cool this one is. Look how many stamps it has. Yeah, they just... That's so of, many! Instead of paying the postage, they individually stamped it. Historic preservation. How, where is it from? Flip it. San Francisco. We did it. This is from RL. Oh my god. Did no! R Goosebumps joke. <coughs> did you think I was going to hit you? No. Did, I, did I see a flinch out of the corner of my eye? No. Okay. <laughs> and honestly, if you were going to hit me, I think I'd probably just let you hit me. Right. Because that, that's that's that, how we operate. At that point, uh, eh. okay. like if you're going to try and hit me, my, try. my attempt to block it, if anything, is going to make the situation probably worse. Okay. Not oh, this is the other part of that. Uh... Here we go. You can have that. I have to read more note. Oh. This is the other part of that note. Oh no, I get Also it. enclosed, nope. Yeah. Also enclosed. Was Christianopoly taken? They couldn't call it Christianopoly. One large and one small. The large box contains a truly cringeworthy Christian board game that I tweeted to Papa Jake a while back, but sorry, it's not the Bible Man game. 
It's called the Rich Christian. The Richest Christian. This is actually in really good shape. It is in really good shape, and I really like the art on it, even though it's... How old is this game? Because the art <coughs> makes me think this is from, like, the, the 50s? The 70s, at no, the very least? No, 60s. 50s, no, 60s. the material's way too new. It's just old-style art. Yeah, you might be right. Well, no, this is kind of what I grew up on. It, it, it was kept in pristine 86. condition. Wow. This was kept in pristine. I don't think this has ever been opened. I think this is like. Look at these. These are fucking nice. Listen to this. Listen to me crack this board open. I think this is the first time this has been opened. It's like. Does it smell good? It smells old. Smell these cars. They smell like 80s. This smells like 80s too. Yeah. <coughs> this definitely is. This is what the board looks like if anyone's curious. It's all in like pristine condition though. If I were a wow. board, like if I were a board game collector, okay, I'd be... Okay, I think we should play this. Yeah, we should definitely play this. We can play this downstairs cuz we okay. have the the camera for it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. There we go. Send that to Board James. You know who Board James is? Uh, I assume it's Does a guy, Board Games! A guy named James is... Yeah. See, I didn't know, but I... Intrinsically... It's a good name. Yeah. Okay. God damn it. Ugh. Ugh. This one is from... Nope, just Amazon again. Nobody loves this. But Chris! Wouldn't it be nice? Which Islamic majority country would you like to visit? <laughs> Dubai, but only for like five minutes <coughs> and I'll shop and I'll get the fuck out. A peanut went in me. Oh. If somehow, like 80 years from now, Mecca were somehow like open as like a historical site. <coughs> you know what I mean? But I'm not going to live long enough for that to be open to infidels. Hmm. I would like to look at Palestine from the walls of Israel. <laughs> oh! Uh. <laughs> it gets harder and harder every day. <laughs> oh, they sent you the thing. <laughs> I should have brought mine so we could have done the thing. <laughs> <laughs> that is fucking awesome, though. <laughs> yeah, there's a Hi, thing. Jake! Here's your blank. Now I want that one hour video of you and Hugo playing. Okay. This is from Steven. This is. The Dragon Zord. Dragon Zord. Does it come with the sword? Do -do 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 -do. The tail used to turn into a thing. I think it might. It used to turn into, you know what I'm saying? Like a big. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Let's open her up. It's a Dragon Zord. I haven't seen one of these since I was six. Go I was in kindergarten. Green Corey. Ranger. Corey. Who is now, Go. he grew up and he went to jail. He went to actual prison. When I was six years old, we were playing with dragon zords together. I had the megazord. He had the dragon zord. We traded so we could play. And then he's like, no. You can't play with the dragon zord. I want to play with it. Guess who's and I cried! Bitch, guess who's got a dragon sword and isn't in prison now? B -b 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 <laughs> win! It's a cosmic win. It took 24 years. Not bad. Uh, Chris, no Morocco, Malaysia, or Indonesia? Those aren't the countries people think when you say Muslim country. He wanted no to, offense to those countries. It was, it was, it was Chris being like, Ha ha, didn't you know that these were Islam? Oh. You spent two seven dollars on that? Come on, Chris. <laughs> Can I see the instructions for this? Yeah. Oh, shit. Does it have metal articulation? This is actually fucking dope, dude. Yeah. Those I was are really... way better than the, the American yeah, they, versions, <laughs> yeah, actually. Yeah, they are. Wow. Yeah. See? Look at that. The Power Rangers Legacy stuff is really high quality. And is I'm this Legacy? I'm a little concerned because uh, Hasbro recently bought Saban, and I'm a little concerned. Oh, the, that's the over. I'm a concerned the quality is going to go, well, go down. Well, the old uh, Transformers were dope. Yeah. Is this a stand for it? Um, I don't know. What? Oh my god, and you can combine it with the yeah. Megazord to make the super How Megazord. it was when we were kids, yeah. I, uh, that's awesome. That's why we had to play with them for an hour. Okay. 
the build that has to be to the... Okay, that's fine. There's your instructions. I like... Are you framing scenes for it already? The build-up has to be... The build-up has to be us putting it together. Wow, this is end. really heavy. There you go. Hold that. Yeah, that's heavy as shit. He's got a cod piece because he's a dragon. And you need to protect those. <laughs> dragon dick. He's all... Oh, yeah, and then the arms folded out, but I don't remember how. Yeah, it took me a while to remember on the other one, too. Is it a button? But once you do it, like, twice, you'll figure it out. Do I just pull it out with my fingers? Don't force it. You'll oh, break. Oh, no. Wait, there's a there's a slidey boy here. There you go. <laughs> did it shoot, like, missiles out of its yeah, fingers? Yeah, no, it did. It shot... Yeah. It shot... Ugh. This one's hard. This one's hard to do. Ah, I don't want to break it. I'm gonna leave that there. Money well spent. Ever consider my minda midango? I mind mindango. I don't know where that is. I don't. What? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna learn about this before I tear it apart. But it's dope. I didn't know it had Z's on the bottom of its feet. That's pretty cool. That makes sense. Uh oh. Oh no. Here they are. Here's there's other there's other hands. Differently articulated. Yep. Something like that. Oh, these fingers articulate. Yeah, I think they're I think they're for posing. Sure. Yeah. Very cool. Very, very cool. This is the way to our hearts. Yes, yeah, so I'll always take either Power Rangers or Marvel memorabilia. <sighs> Remember the good parts of your childhood? That's when your dad loved you! No. <laughs> uh Uh, Mindanao? No one has ever considered that. Not even those that live there. I'm trying to move this box over. We have a few more. I can't believe it's still happening. Oh, God. I know, we got a lot of packages this oh, time. Oh, God. Okay. Ugh. This one's heavy. And it's fragile. Well, this one's from Holden. I feel like this person has sent us stuff before. Does that name look familiar to you? Yes. Okay. I once knew a Holden by the name of Caulfield. He was a phony! Eh, catch her in the ride jokes, no? Okay. Any other AP lit people in the house? No? I'm trying to- okay. I'm trying to hold back the thunder. The thunder? The thunder. The thunder. Yeah, that's what we call it when we beat the Hugo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wouldn't that, be fun? Wouldn't that be funny? It have doesn't you ever, need a snap. Have you ever name. have you ever met somebody that thought of themselves in a way like that? No. That like I, would talk in the third person. I wish to like a '90s bully TV drama. Yeah. Don't mess with Buck. You know what I mean? And but he's Buck. Yeah, I get what you're yeah. saying. Nope, never encountered it. You guys ever watch ContraPoints? I love ContraPoints. Yeah, Natalie, come come do a thing. I think she'd hate us. So that's are we are we that problematic? No, she wouldn't hate us. I don't know. I'm very self-conscious. Oh, these are stale now. Here were some uh, corn tortilla chips, but those, those those popped. Unless yeah. that's just how they are. No, I can feel air There's, coming out of yeah, it that's, somewhere. They got ruined. Probably because you put a book below them. It's got a nice old picture of Julia and uh, Lilia Garcia. Okay, if you're gonna send us tortilla you know chips, authentic. you need to reinforce the package. Looks like it looks like they haven't had sex in thirty years. That's, That's how you know the tortilla chips are good. He spent all his time working on the chip. Do you want to try to read a long handwritten letter? I will do my best. Okay, this is also college boot camp. This is not a porn surprise. Dear Hugo and Jake, first you can read this out loud for the stream if. Live? It, if, it, okay. It's yeah. always live. These are various Christian homeschool books my mom found in storage <coughs> from my childhood. They have some pretty insane shit in them. It's also included sheets. Sh I've also included snacks per J Jake's request. Julio's is a Texas-only brand of tortilla chip. They are delicious. Not anymore, they are not. Well, let's see the bag. Give me the bag. Anyway... For some further background, I was... Oh, <laughs> your handwriting, bro. So much worse than mine. Is I, it? It's about the same. <clears throat> For 
for the background, I was... <laughs> you backpedaled immediately. Yeah. Once Ooh. challenged, I'll, uh... Not still! Okay. In an emotionally and verbally abusive Christian wow, those are conservative good. household, stereotypical... Holy shit. What's on these? Is there MSG on these? No? Yes! MSG. Ha! Called it. Take a little bite of that. Yes, that's good. Yeah. Woo! I live in Oklahoma, so mo so not very religious. You drink. So not being very religious is social suicide. Having other non-religious people just be themselves has been a huge comfort. It's also fun to see Christianity ripped apart because I'm still a little bitter. Anyway, <laughs> I hope the books prove interesting and you like the chips. Thank you for all that you do. Uh, P.S. I'm now a high school zoology teacher, which means <laughs> I'm literally the atheist, evolution-teaching, college-educated, pot-smoking liberal teacher that Christians are so scared of. The students think I'm cool as hell. That's Don't cool. dox them. Uh, no, no, I'm not going. <laughs> Apparently people liked it when I fed you. That's that's never happening again. Can we not? That's never happened. Actually, I'll feed him for a hundred dollars. Let's see if it works. Let's see. If <laughs> Don't it works. say that. What if, what if it happened? We could just no, do it. feel bad. We can just do things where we feed each other. That's it. Then that's our job. Then we're a fetish channel. So? Oh, that's fair. Who gives a shit? Do you want some? Fu and, and it could be with the fetish is we don't want to do it, but we're beholden. To the crowd. That makes sense. You want some SpaghettiOs? Not really. Hundred dollars. God damn. God damn it. Gotta eat the, the, gotta eat the SpaghettiOs now. Alright. Alright. Let your freaky friends know. <laughs> we'll check out these textbooks, by the way. Okay, I'm here's sure a biology. In. Oh, they have uh, abortion? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, in a biology book? The tragedy of abortion? This is amazing. Here you go. Uh, college boot camp. How to thrive as a Christian at college. Uh, only soak. Only soak, never hump. American government in Christian perspective. The Second Amendment is as important as Jesus. Done. American government in a Christian perspective. Second edition. Guns are still important, but even more Wait, than there's Jesus. There's a political comic. I want to read what it... All right, here you go. go. Oh. MSG is monosodium glutamate. Yes, thank you. Oh my god! There's literally a fucking thing in this, like, being like, the, the EPA, fuck the EPA. This little comic here is like, the EPA will come onto your land until you can't build on it. Because endangered species, so fuck the EPA. Wow. That's uh, propaganda. That's not a textbook at all. Book of Revelation, church history. My, my government books, for the record, had opposing perspectives, and there was a debate section at the end of each. This is the way to do it. Uh, so this is Revelation, but also, um, apparently, Jews. Life management, home teacher materials. Don't need that. Obviously, we have our lives together. Um, home teacher materials. I'd like to point out how thin this is. Yeah. This is barely a leaflet. <laughs> the book of the Revelation, church history, and then it, Revelation home teacher materials. This is just like you need a desk. You need a computer and a DVD player. Yep. Here are the videos to show them. Uh, do it. <laughs> That's sad. That's yeah. the saddest shit ever. Uh, the handwriting makes a little more sense now, no offense. Okay, anyway. so... So... Now we have presents from Paul. When he came and visit last time, he gave us presents. I believe this one was yours. I could be wrong. I got a Paul Allen ID, but he looks like a baby. Look at him. Aw, uh, he's got a little, he's got one of those spit curls at the front too. Oh, Paul. Get... Oh, Paul. <laughs> Was this another just just stuff you found in a drawer thing? They were, but th why did he give them to each of us? Because look. Look. I, I got a kitchen sink. Is that, maybe we got switched. 
Maybe McGee and Me. These are McGee and Me books. Maybe they're Switch, because these seem like things you would like. Maybe. Here's a Tigger. Did we want a Switch? I don't know. I have no idea, but you can have those books. Okay. They're McGee and Me books. We'll see. The more I delve into this, the more it will become apparent. This is definitely for you. Okay. This is definitely for you, because it's, it's got a stuffed slider thing. <laughs> Wait, I had a toilet and a ticker though? Yeah. I like both of those things. Ah, you undersold the ticker altogether. Firmly undersold. And I'll tell you why. This ticker's going on safari. Catch Just one asbesto. Catch up with Jesus. Five Canadian dollars. If Jesus was walking in water and he turned into wine, would he fall in? And he turned it into one. What is that? Oh, that's a that's a that's a dick. That's a dick. The Paul Allen, and it is a glass dick signed by Paul Allen. Huh. I respect that. You know. Thank you, Paul. Ragtime, the musical. Maybe this one was for you. Maybe he got us mixed up. Here's Ragtime the Musical keychain. Discovery Channel keychain. Why does Paul own so many keychains? Sink keychain? Yeah, this like, one's dirty, though. It's like a dirty every, sink keychain. E like, every week does he see a new keychain and he just goes, oh my god, I need to buy this keychain. I think that's exactly what happened. It's, I think every single yes. time his husband goes, we just, you can't have this many keychains. Uh, that's, that's not even a, this isn't a bit. This is exactly how it is. Yeah. With Paul. You just go... You just go, no. Yeah, this is yours. Oh, I got ketchup and you got relish! <laughs> oh, it's adorable! Okay, Fran Drescher. It's adorable! <laughs> so yeah, this one is for you, but I'm going to continue to open it. Just fuck you! This is, uh... A poem about friendship. We like your shirt. We like you too. We made a refrigerator magnet. Love Team Caruso. That's not a fucking poem. There's a clip. We got a clip. Chris says, can you review Nollywood, Nigerian movies? Uh, I don't know of any. I've seen the one I think they reviewed on Half in the Bag or whatever. Oh boy. More Paul Allen pictures. Uh, these, this is a fridge magnet. Okay. That's not it. We have one more gift from Paul. But first, we have Super Chats. One from Chris. No, that was the other one. Uh, when are we getting Jake body pillows from Danny McGuire? Never! Uh, this is a little mug uh, that Paul and I found that's just for you. We were, at, we were shopping, and Paul was like, I need to get this for Hugo. God damn it. <laughs> it's a Space Jam mug. <laughs> so you got a Space Jam mug. I get it! So every morning, every morning, you can grab a hot cup of joe and be reminded of your successes. Like in Space Jam when they overcome the Monstars. I'm not familiar. I've actually never seen the film. Oh, really? <laughs> You've never seen Space Jam, well, maybe the 1996 should... seminal basketball classic starring Michael Jordan in a live act. Yeah, Is it 94? Yeah, I, I, should, I should sit down and maybe uh, take a look at it. You should probably take a long, long look at it at one time. Okay, maybe view it. Maybe view maybe it. Maybe view it again. Over, review it, you know, whatever. Yeah. Anyway. I'm sure you haven't done that. Yeah. <laughs> so... There's a Dan Aykroyd joke in that one. I know Dan Aykroyd was in this picture, but it's Bill Murray. Because apparently they used to have like a like a Ben Affleck, Matt Damon thing going on. Anyway, and that was the joke. So 1994 was a wild time. Is that all their stuff? Larry Bird was there. Newman. I love that movie. 
So I guess that's it. If you want to send us more stuff, you can find the, the, the our P.O. box. Might be in the description. If not, you can find it on Jake's Twitter bio on Twitter at no. Papa Bird Jake. It's P.O. Box 6544, Saginaw, Michigan 48608. There it is. Woo! So until next time, I'm Hugo. I'm Jake. And also, uh, stay tuned. We're going to be doing another live stream, but not on this channel. It's yeah. going to be on your, what, your Twitch let's, thing? Let's call it 845-ish. Uh, it'll be on Twitch, at actual Jake. If you have me on Twitter, it'll be announced on Twitter. If you haven't followed already, do it. Hurry, man, for engine send. And Jake, I'll give you five more dollars if you take all of his other mug and leave him... Only the Space Jam mug. I, I got that he typed that as fast as he could, so there's some typos. I respect it. Are you gonna make sliders? Yeah, I make burgers. No, I mean, are you gonna make sliders with that yeah. contraption? No, yeah, why? Is it just plastic? What, do you mm. just nuke it? I'm actually not sure. No, I don't think so. Can you feel that? You don't put that in the oven. You certainly don't put that on a stove. I think this yeah, is I just, think, no, I think it's just for forming the patties. Is it just for the patty forms? I think so. Oh. You just okay. All right. Yeah. You just push her, push her down. Oh. You can't just, you can't just go like this. I don't know. Those are for so they're uniform. Okay. Let's follow us over there. The actual Jake. Uh, switch. Switch. Until next time, you go. Ah.